Hey guys, it's Miss Downs. Uh, just wanted to say hi and check in and see how everyone's doing. Um, I have been staying home for the most part, except for going to get groceries and walking my dogs and stuff. Um, as far as what I've been up to, um, mostly just watching baking shows on Netflix and playing PS4. I've also hung up some new decorations. I'll show you one of the things I hung up. My Star Wars poster and my lightsaber. I finally got those hung up. I've uh, been doing some cleaning. Um, but yeah, that's pretty much all I've been up to right now. Uh, hope to hear from you guys. I'll uh, see you later. Hey guys, I wanted to take the time to show you today that I'm in here in my house and I am in front of my fireplace. It's one of my favorite places in the house. Um, I really enjoy it so much because um, it took so long for this house to be built and um, it was something that I wanted for a long time and we finally saved enough money and we were able to build this house and I'm saying all that to let you know that I know that good things are worth the wait and that's why I know that waiting to see you and to be with you again is definitely going to be worth the wait. It'll be just as exciting as getting to build this house and um, to see everything come together. So today I wanted to say that um, I really miss Chloe. Chloe, I miss you because I miss coming in and seeing you wearing your little headphones on your head and um, protecting your ears. I miss listening to your smart conversations that you have with other students and talking with the teachers. And I really miss how that you always raise your hand in class no matter what because you always seem to know the answers. And I miss that you, um, sometimes we come in down in the morning to get your headphones and you'll come in the room and you'll have a conversation with me. And I miss those conversations in the morning. And my other shout out today is going out to Mason. Mason, I was so excited. I got to see you in the parking lot the other day and I know we had to keep our distance and we could only do air hugs, but I was really happy to see you. I just loved um, being able to see that big smile that I can always count on from you and you were so excited and you always have all of this energy. You're just a little bundle of joy and I really miss um, about you. I miss that clean, clean desk and that nice organization. I also miss that you almost always raise your hand during class to answer questions because you always seem to kind of have the answers together. I miss that you have all of your assignments done no matter what and that you're always ready to take on the next new thing. I miss you guys and I hope you're doing well. See you later. Bye-bye. Hey everybody, it's Miss Huber again, having some fun with my phone here. I just wanted to check in with you and tell you again how much I miss you. I can't wait to be together again. I've been wondering so much what you guys have been up to, what you've been doing. I've been working in my yard a lot. I hang out with my dog. He keeps me company. We're buddies. And uh, I want to know what you've been doing. Send us a message or maybe go to the White Rock Art Room and put a picture on there. I love to see your faces. I miss you, I love you, and I hope to talk to you soon. Say bye, Leo. Morning, White Rock Elementary. Mrs. Bethel here again. I'm sitting at my kitchen table, getting ready for my day. And one of the things I do um, to help me to relieve some stress and anxiety and boredom is I create lists for myself of things that I need to do to help to keep myself on a schedule and a routine. So this morning, that's what I'm working on, working on what do I need to do for today. Um, this might be a good idea for you to try it. It might help you to, like I said, relieve some of that maybe boredom and anxiety or stress that you have going on, especially at this time when you're stuck at home. Um, so today I have laundry on my list and I'm going to work on that this morning. I've also listed out, um, have a faculty meeting that I have to attend over, um, internet on Google Hangouts. And then I have, um, homework that I have to do for my master's class. Um, sometimes I, when I list out my goals, 
I will maybe do them for the day or I might do them for the whole week depending on what I have going on. And like I said, this really helps me to keep focused on what I need to accomplish. And it also makes me feel really good as I go through the list and I check them off, then I know, hey, this is what I've gotten done and um, I've been productive and I'm getting some things finished around that um, the house that I needed to, that I haven't maybe had time for um, whenever we were in school. So you might give it a try. Don't set your goals too high to where they're not accomplishable and because um, sometimes that'll bring you down and you might give it a shot. Like I said, it, it definitely helps you to see, hey, look at all the stuff that I can get finished within a day. And then you look around and you're like, wow, good for me. I got this done. So um, like I said before, if you ever need to get in touch with me or if you need any help with anything, make sure that you uh, just email me. It's pretty much the same email I think as everyone else where you have your first initial. So it'd be a Bethel at McDonaldR1.net. Let me know, or even if you don't have internet, well, you probably won't see this video, but um, you can always give a call to the school and I can call you back. Okay. Um, miss and love you guys always. Hope you have a great day today. It's going to be pretty outside. And those are always one of my goals is to get outside and enjoy some fresh air. So you do the same. Okay. All right. Hope to see you soon. Bye-bye.